All right, I'm here with Nergis Beni Asadi, who is the founder of Bina Technologies. Congratulations, you just won a Best Practices Award. Um, will you tell me a little bit about the product? Sure. Uh, we are very happy to be at BioIT. We launched our company actually here in 2012 for the first time came out of stilts mode and now we are here being also part of Roche uh, company. So we are focused on building informatic solutions for next generation sequencing. And that informatic solution covers from uh, you know people aspect, how to foster collaboration between scientists, mm -hmm. all the way to technology which providing very good and accurate, fast, scalable pipelines and workflows, as well as solving the infrastructure problems in terms of scalability, security, and compliance. You had an announcement today that yes. came out from under embargo today. Can you tell me a little bit about that? So our flagship product is called Bina Genomic Management Solution. And this is a very good fit for the large scale research uh, efforts that a lot of pharmaceutical or clinical institutes are pursuing. So we announced just yesterday a very big and impactful collaboration with AstraZeneca. In that collaboration, AstraZeneca is to globally deploy Bina Genomic Management Solution across different, you know, multiple sites to enable that type of genomic analysis and uh, deploy and kind of uh, consume genomic information in the discovery and research at AstraZeneca that will lead to much more targeted, personalized therapy development, hopefully. Comparing year over year, how do you feel like we're doing this year? I'm actually very happy with the progress. I think you guys are doing a great job. Congratulations. So for example, I see more and more the end users are talking about their informatics challenges versus the vendors say, oh, I have this solution, I'm great. I think we all are interested to hear from end user perspective, whether clinical or pharmaceutical or research, uh, what are the problems they're dealing with so that all the vendors go home and then build a better product. So I think that is a trend I'm observing here and of course also more and more diverse set of vendors displaying their solutions, so I think it's great. Tell me a little bit about the Bina Alliance program. Okay. Sure, thanks for asking. So we are uh, now being part of Roche. We are really accelerating our commercialization and the completion of the product. And we are launching two very important programs to work with uh, you know, other players in the field. One of them is Bina Alliance program. Bina Alliance program, the first member of it is AstraZeneca, as we you know, announced yesterday. And it is targeting really large uh, clinical research institutes as well as pharmaceutical institutes. In this partnership, we are uh, kind of aiming to develop our product further. So it's not just only you know providing the product and, and walk away. It is a co-development of a product and we hope that through this very limited number of alliances we uh, create a new standard for the industry, how to consume genomic information in research. And the other program we have is been a research grant. So through that we want to work with the academic institution and universities who um, you know, have slightly different needs and different budgets and we see it as a contribution to the society. We want to provide them with free access to a lot of solutions that we have built. So both of the programs are on our website uh, if you need more information, but this is the time to enroll because you know, we, there will be a limited window and hopefully before everything is signed up you can enroll. Thanks.